so we missed yesterday because it was my brother and godson's birthday but we are out here downtown i almost said downtown turlo downtown modesto american graffiti day two for us day sunday monday tuesday wednesday day four for them damn that's nice i hear oh, oh yeah all right i thought it was a cop i like this buggy with the roof rack on top that's nice okay okay ls swap damn that motherfucker ls swap I'm trying my best not to cuss so I can have this for kids, but it's so difficult. Especially when there's like builds like this. This is cool. And it's like, baby. What is the boy's name? Bam Bam. The boy's name is Bam Bam? Oh, it's both the boy. I think it is Bam Bam. Bam Bam's nose looking kind of weird. This is cool. Chevy Bel Air. Oh wait, no, Chevy Nomad? I think. Let's go this way. I think the music starts at 6.30 today. There's supposed <laughs> to be like a live band or something. It's a nice truck. Hey yo, what the heck? Is that a Lexus? That is a Lexus with 350Z wheels. Somebody got their JDM in here. I could park my car in here then? What the heck, man? I didn't wash it, but still. This is cool. This is cool. <laughs> right next to a Nova and a GTO. Surprised to see that. I like that. It's a donk. So this is pretty much like a sneak peek of what, ooh that Corvette is nice, of what's coming up uh, Friday is the American Graffiti Parade, if you guys do not know that, come out, if you're a viewer that's not in Modesto area, I got you covered, I'll record as much as I can. I'm gonna try to get into a car for the parade. I'm gonna do my best just to jump into a moving car. Just for you guys. It is a nice color. What the heck? There are like random cars parked in here too. From, we did that show last month. That car is called Betty White. Texas plates, super sport. It goes down that street too. All the low riders. I love it. I think I showed you guys the front of it, but I did not show you the Spider-Man mural. Check out the door panels. Small ass wheel. All the Spider-Man stuff. Very nice. 
Yo, that bus truck is dope. This is definitely a first for me. It's a Volkswagen bus that they cut the back off and put like a utility truck bed. And it looks like it all folds down like a Daihatsu. That shit's crazy too. <laughs> And then you got your gas tank all the way in the back. It really is like the Daihatsu. That is crazy. And he has a land yacht longboard. <coughs> I like this. I dig the style. Appreciate it. I didn't come from factory. Damn, look at that. Hey, yo. One, two. Twin turbo. <laughs> Holy crap. That is intense. I like that warning sign. Stand back, I built this shit myself. <laughs> Josh needs that. He really does. This is crazy. Oh yeah, he definitely drives that. Oh, that's badass. Damn, G. Gotta add another zero to the end of that. Zero to a thousand real quick. Yo, and he has a shifter. This is cool. I'll be right back. I need to make a video on my phone about this one. This one's crazy. All right, we found the one, at least so far. Which one, baby? What is it? No idea. Does the front look like a Ford? What does it kind of look like? The front and the back. Is there anything inside? Did he debadge everything other than that part inside? He really did. Okay. This is a Chevy Nomad. So if this wasn't a wagon, it would be a sedan and it's the Chevy Bel Air. You can tell by the lights. And the headlights. I never heard about that. <laughs> now you know. <laughs> okay, come on. That's a nice C10. I would drive a Hurst. You would drive a Hurst. I would drive that Impala. <laughs> yes. Impala and I can get a Hurst. Deal. Shaking on camera. That's the hat. Oh gosh. This looks like something Elvis would pose in front of. This looks like those murals of Elvis with uh, Marilyn Monroe and uh, what's his name? My dad would love this Corvette. Corvette Stingray with little pop-up headlights. Trippin' 70. <laughs> That's a nice Mustang. This white dude's got Snoop Dogg on his shirt. That's cool with the belts. That's cool. I don't know what that's for, but that's cool. See, this looks more like his car from Tokyo Drift, but I, oh, that's an El Camino. Did he drive an El Camino? Someone drives an El Camino in the new one and it has the turbos on it. Oh, I know, his brother. Jacob drives the El Camino with the, the rockets on it. This, this is my family friend's Chevy Bel Air. And it is pristine. This is the type of car that has never seen rain. The 
That's the type of car that is sprayed and wiped down. Never used a hose on it. Original owner, I want to say. And he's giving it to Jacob, my family friend. I'm like, man, this is the one that I was saying would be fun to take to the wedding. Yeah. I think so. Oh, Greg, may we borrow your Chevy Bel Air? <laughs> How's it going? I think that'll be a fun a fun ride to the wedding. <laughs> Another Chevy Ballet. That dog looks like Chewbacca. <laughs> He's all I see myself. I like the Impala. The ice cream man is following us and he's like tempting me. Yeah. Should we? Do you want one? I don't want one. Ah. The last time I got one, it was just so disappointing. It don't taste the same now. It's because we're adults. Once you become an adult, the ice cream just tastes like money. You know, a lot of these businesses miss out on business by being closed. Honestly, like, I don't know what that one is, but they should have been open. Okay. I didn't know that. No one's, yeah, no one's open. This truck is dope. Is that a wrap too? Okay, we saw one truck that I didn't record that was wrapped. And now I'm like, is that a, that is a wrap. Oh my gosh. People are wrapping classic cars now. This is a sin. Yeah. It's pulling up right there. We're not judging, we're just saying. Oh! The interior though? That's cool. I swear if that's a wrap. Oh boy. I, but the hood is not. Look at the hood. The hood looks cool. Or the roof. I wonder if they have like low rider wrap. That'd be kind of cool. It is a two person bike. It's a tandem bike. It's a bicycle built a for two. Bike. Huh. Oh, okay, so what they did was they put... No? Wait, what the hell? Why does this look so weird? I feel like the back seats are higher up for some reason. They are. Look at it. But like, why though? I thought he cut speakers in there for a house, but now I'm like... Were those That'd supposed be hella to be... comfy to sit right there, man. Yeah, but your head's gonna be right here, and then all the bugs are gonna be smacking you in the face. Uh, are you ready for our thumbnail? Boom. Oh, wait, I got oh. one too. Boom. All right. Is this on? The fans are on. Uh... Hey, yo, why are your fans on, cuz? <laughs> this interior is really nice. Five speed. This is kind of cool. I'm not sure if it's made for the back seats, but it sits flushed. And the speakers are pointing up and out. Good soup. Official pace car, 1979. People are really weird. They like stare when we vlog. I don't think they realize they're doing it though. Hey, not realize you're staring at someone. You're not really thinking about it. That's true. Ooh, quick shout out. 
209 hot rods. If you not follow them on Instagram, you're a wiener. So go follow them so you no longer are considered a wiener. I'm curious on what that is though. Like what is the store? We're gonna look up the store and tell you guys later. It's like only perfume. It's like what the hell? Oh yeah, this is Visit Modesta. If you guys want to follow them, check them out. We will we'll be collabing and doing a pretty cool thing very soon. He's a duck. What? Donald for dollars is here. Hey. This is so weird that there's like modern cars. <laughs> There weren't any of those last year. Yeah, now I'm like, why Why didn't I park in here? Do you have to register for this? Or do you just kind of like show up with the cool car? If you guys don't know, Donuts for Dollars is a really cool dude. And his son name is Prince and he drifts this little thing. I'm wondering where they are. Probably walking around somewhere. Probably find them. Hey, yo. yo. That's pretty dope. Isn't this the one that we saw at the Lowrider show? It is. Because then Josh was like, oh, it's fake. Fake exhaust system. Bum, bum, bum. Ruined it. Nova Custom. This is what Taylor drives? This is... Similar? Uh, I think it's His a little older. Bigger. Yeah, I want to say this one's a little older. But it's about the same color. Isn't his orange? I thought so. I can't say that I've ever seen it in person though. What? I like this little one. This looks oh, it's like a uh, um, Mr. Bean. No. Nope. This is what Mr. Bean would drive. It's a uh, technically you can't say that word. They're considered small people now. But well, I'm not wrong. They're fun size car no, for fun size like people. Something that like Audrey Hepburn drives in one of her movies. Is or... that? I'm just kidding. He's an old white lady that did. What? They got tissues. But when you blow your wop. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't know that reference, I'm gonna I'm a put that in because that's funny. I'm not 100% you would fit in with your legs, babe. Yeah, there's room down there. A lot of the length and the leg room. Oh, what the heck? It's like, it comes it really like all is, the way out yeah. Here. Your legs are like. That's how the bug was. I wonder how hot that would be, because then it's right by your, your tires. I hope they have good insulation. I mean, it's from back then. I wouldn't really, uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> All right, I have a question for the viewers. Who is this Funko Pop? We have no idea. He's just his arms are crossed. Little dog. Little wiener dog. All right, back to the question. Who is this man? Comment in the. Oh, Dan, Danny DeVito. I feel like it's someone from uh, Godfather, but I've never watched that, so I don't. I don't really know. What kind of red would you say that is? It's like a deep cherry red. Like a ruby red? Or is ruby lighter? Ruby is lighter. Maybe it's more like a sapphire. Or a plum? Plum red. Plum is 
Also, in the comments. It's like a warhead red. That's what color the red warheads are. Use right. Use right. In the comments, tell me, how do you get in this car? No it's door handle. It's Santa Claus's car. When he walks up to it, the door handle appears. It goes beep, beep, beep. Oh, yeah. Ooh, buy a cut. Oh, that baby looked straight at me. That's nice. Some fat tires in the back. Damn, this is cool. I don't think I've ever seen a truck like that. It looks like a limo truck. It looks like one of those renders. Because if that's a short bed, if I had a long bed, that would look so freaking good. It kind of looks like they cut it and put it together, actually, now I'm looking at it. I don't know a whole lot about trucks, but I'm guessing the super makes it a super long trip. This is nice. This is the car that Dwight drives <laughs> in the office. This is the one that he crashes into the pole and he throws up on the front of it this is blue whoa Point. hey yo the flames though 35 grand does it say how many miles if you're interested in this call dave for thirty-five thousand dollars or best offer your first born a packet of cigarettes and a hot dog only if he's good looking. <laughs> what? That dude said it's cheap. 35 grand? Okay, then cheap. buy it. Yeah, pay for my <laughs> wedding, bro. What the hell? Ding, ding, ding. Ding, ding, ding. I'll buy it right now. I call cab. I like that pinch stripe. It's like wild style. It looks like Kingdom Hearts. Wow. It really does. <laughs> A good call, baby. I like the pink. It makes it look like neon swirlies. This building so pretty. This looks like uh, where look Spider-Man. This looks like where Spider-Man oh, yeah. uh, does the newspaper, the Daily Bugle. It looks like we're in downtown Disney in California Adventure. With the building. Spider-Man, the uh, menace. Pretty spot on. I like this. Oh, wait up. Is this a wrap? Now I can't trust anybody. Oh, wait, no, it's not a wrap. It's cracking. Uh, it's paint. You're good. It's too shiny to be wrapped. I mean, what the heck is that? He's got a serious FM little antenna on top. What the heck? This looks very snug. Very snug. I like the pinstripe. I like the pinstripe in the inside too. Very nice. Alright, we made our way down. They're doing the... What's it called? Uh, they're doing speeches. Now they're doing speeches for the Walk of Fame. I think this is one of them. The Historic Graffiti Cruise Route. It shows all of this. And then they have like the Walk of Fame, like our style stars for American Graffiti. Maybe we'll go get some, some footage of it. Cool. So this is what I'm talking about, Legends of the Cruise. And then it's the stars. Yay! I don't know what happened. She plays the younger sister in American Graffiti. I'm gonna get I'm gonna try to get a little closer for this. Alright, be right back. This is pretty cool. The museum has a little souvenir coin thing, and we turned it. We try to I don't know if my GoPro's gonna focus, but it's pretty cool. We also didn't read the directions and we turned it prematurely and it like made it halfway. 
So we just abandoned that one and we just left it there, so yeah. So we have somewhat made it to the end. We walked through all of the downtown area. We got ourselves some boba. What do you think of your taro route? You got taro? Taro milk. Taro milk, what do you think? Better than quickly. Ooh. I love quickly. Okay. It's too late. You already said it. But this is better. <laughs> Damn. This is where I originally came and got the pineapple slush with the scoop of ice cream. Back in like 2014. Almost 10 years ago. All right. I spotted this and I have no idea what it is. J and O Griffo? Crillo? Griffo? I don't know. It looks dope. Check this out. <laughs> That's not it. This is pretty crazy. What is that? Cold air intake? That is a cold air intake, right? What the hell? All right, right now they are inaugurating some people that are special to Modesto. And then they have these spots that I showed you earlier. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six. No, five. One, two, three, four, five. And they're gonna uncover them. They're gonna say their name. And there's people like, waiting to record it, which is kind of cool, kind of weird. What? What was that? Were you flexing or like? No, I had something stuck to my finger and I couldn't get it off. All right, let's check out more cars. That's a nice color. I love like a, a huge go-kart. I like this truck. I like that color. More than a nice. El Camino? Across from an El Camino? Across from an El, El Camino? Across from a Corvette. <laughs> I don't think that Corvette's technically old enough to be here, but we'll accept it because it's a Corvette. There's a couple things that I'm like... That Lexus that was down there was very... Confusing. I'm like, I can understand if it was a Datsun because old school, but yeah, that was a little weird. It is what it... Oh, convertible bug. Oh, this is clean as hell. And they got cup holders. <laughs> Look how like... <coughs> whoa, 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 whoa. There's a sign Maui built. Bum, bum, bum. We gotta go. This is dope. There's a freaking skull, dude. It's a wild willy. Freaking wheelie bar. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's some, Tony. oh my gosh. I was just about to say some Chemico is playing their Tony. music. We know the blue truck. Hi, Tony. Nope. Okay, wait, what? Dual heads? Double head? Double header? <laughs> Double head. <laughs> Double head. Uh. I don't know why I like that. Because it's badass. Like, I don't normally like this style of plane, but I kind of dig this. It's dope. Kind of 
I want to say this is technically what you would say is a lead sled. This is Road Dogs. Road Dog, I salute you. This is badass. This I place love the smells amazing. Cochina and tequila bar. You're at nine percent. Baby, it's it's not cochina. Co cochina. I don't know, it's not cochina. Cochina means dirty. Cochina. Co cochina and tequila. <laughs> what? Oh, the murals. If you have not been out the here. The end is cool. The one with the, the dude taking his hand, finger off? The three eyes? Yeah. That is pretty cool. And he's doing the joke. Joke? Boo. Here, hold this. Oh, I got it. Boo. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know how to do it. I got this. <laughs> wow. You're welcome. That's my husband, guys. Like, like, and subscribe. How much pressure does that put on the tires? I don't know about that. All right, we're gonna cool. we're gonna call it for tonight because I'm at like two percent. So day two for us is a wrap. I think tomorrow is in Riverbank. We might it go is. to that. Yeah, Galaxy. We might go to that. I don't know. Not hundred percent. I might be giving away some buttons, so we'll see. <laughs>